is Dalton, Dave here at Coyote Classics, and Mike. And today we have a special surprise for you in this enclosed trailer. Also, we're gonna check out some of the other new inventory that came in this week. This is a 1969 Camaro convertible with over 120,000 spent on the restoration. This is just probably one of the nicest Camaros I've seen, let, yeah, let alone of. I'm in love, I mean. Dave's the perfect guy for the video today, he's a huge 69 Camaro guy. I he's love 69 right Camaros, now. yep, this absolutely. Like factory tack, perfect color. can't beat it when they just show up this, this clean and nice. Hood pops up like a dream. Look in this engine compartment. Wow. This is like just coming right off the trailer. We haven't even, this is the first time it's been on our lot. We haven't touched yeah. it. It's just this clean. Restoration was just finished. You know, underneath just as nice as the top side of it. A blueprint engine, aluminum heads, AC, power four wheel disc brakes, power steering. Everything you want. Yeah. I love the Foose wheels too. Beautiful hugger orange. Should we drive this thing, Dave? I think we should. All right. I think it's our job. <laughs> Warm her up a little bit, but it seems like she just wants to go. She doesn't really want to. She does anything. want to go. Oh, yeah. Tilt wheel, too. How nice is that? Nice. You know, you think it's warmer out, but it's actually cold today. It looks, it looks warm, yeah. but it's cold. restoration hasn't been through our shop yet for fine tuning but it goes down the road really nice looks like it might need a tire balance again there's not many miles on this restoration so we'll bring it in we'll kind of go through it yeah you know, just put the mightest touch on it we say but dash pad dash is perfect oh yeah Dad works speedometer works nice yeah. car very nice car we'll turn around and head back we've got some other new cars to check out um, that just came in this week also Sounds good. We got some neat stuff in here too, Dave, that you might not have seen yet that just came in. Oh, wow. Um, I didn't yeah, that, know that Nova just arrived. No, that came in, um, what was it, yesterday? Yesterday okay. afternoon? Worked out a trade. It came in from Florida. Wow, okay. This car is super crisp. Uh, Chad and I ordered some new chrome wheels for it. This car is super nice. You know, just the black just doesn't do a whole lot for us. So we ordered, uh, you know, wheel well molding, rock, rocker uh, molding, and then some, you know, 17 inch chrome that will wheels. That will set it off for sure. Because the, the gold's a beautiful color, but right yeah, now it just needs a little bit of that trim just to make it pop. This is one of the smoothest driving, like crisp cars I've drove in a long time. Feel the door panels, it's all a custom leather. It's nice. like super soft. And those seats too. Oh yeah, yep. Those seats are fantastic, four speed. Um, that definitely make it a good drive. But even just like everything, we have pictures of the restoration. Look at how the car. door closed. Yeah, every single piece was off this car when it was restored. All the glass was out. You know, nothing on this car was untouched during the restoration. Wow. Um, AC. Because it came from Florida. Yep. So Dual electric fans. Power brakes, like. power steering. Yeah. It's got disc brakes. This thing is really neat. I'm excited to see it with a little bit different look. Yep. Even just the way the doors open and shut, door jam paint. I like the shift around there too, yeah. that's cool. This thing is crisp, super nice car. Oh look, real nice. And then our Cuda that we showed last week, um, you know, made it to the website. We got the cage out of it, got it all detailed up. This thing was a lot of fun. Chad and I drove this uh, yesterday. Yeah.
All right. <laughs> so talk is cheap. Let's see what this thing can do. Talk about the rest of the shit later. How's that yeah. sound? Love the gauge setup. Awesome. Yeah, awesome it's like car. throws you right back. What a nice Cuda. As far as uh does not have power, but it's got the disc brakes, right? There's your yep. brakes. Stops great. Let's do it even idle here to stop sign. Chad was saying it had like 550 horse on it. Yeah, it's a quick car. Yeah, built 440. Um undercarriage is super nice too, painted body color underneath. I like it. And a lot of cars sold too. We ended up selling eight cars last week and four so far. You know, between Monday this and week. Tuesday. Yes. So, a lot of a lot of cars moving out of here, and, and a lot of new cars coming in. Yet. So, if you like something, definitely call us right away. Don't waste time because there's a lot of people looking at our site, and once they pop on, Absolutely. all it takes is a call and they're gone. Jason just pulled this in here. This is ready for photos today. Um, this Q code Mach One. This car is absolutely beautiful. Yeah. Fantastic color, beautiful interior. This I like that it has a red and black interior. That looks sharp. Oh, me too. Yeah, this one will be going up on the site yeah. today. Makes me think, the seats make me think of Deadpool. Yeah, it kind of does, doesn't it? <laughs> it does, doesn't it? Yeah, the red mock interior. Yep. Yeah. Gorgeous car. I know this one will go fast. We've had a lot of interest on uh, this one here, so. That thing is just sharp and just really, really quality. Especially with a Q-code engine in there. With Ram Air. Let's open the hood once. So Q code, that means it's like a 351 Super Cobra jet? Yeah. Yep. It's got the Ram Air. Oh yeah. All the correct markings on the engine. We got a little Fairlane in too that we'll check oh. out. We're just gonna kinda this week we're just gonna hit the, the new inventory. Yeah. All the other stuff, you know, we can go to coyoteclassics.com. It's up there on the site with photos, you know, individual video walkarounds and test drives. Um, so make sure you check that out. Today we're just going to go over um, just some of the new stuff since we got so much new inventory in um, this past week. So we'll jump out to the fair lane and we'll show you that. So this one came in last night. I haven't even really had a chance to look around it real close, but 66 fair lane. This car is going to be super popular. They're just hard to find. Um, every time we have one, it's like they go quick. Yeah, they they're do. just crazy amount of calls. This one's all, beautiful color too. Just original under the hood. Again, we haven't washed it, detailed it, nothing. Um, could run in a little small block forward. So it says the 289 emblems on the side. Is that yep. what we still have in it? Yep. Okay. And we'll run the numbers when it gets checked in with previous owners gotcha. that still has the 289 in it. The interior really looks pretty nice too. It's like newer door panels were installed. Yeah. I like the wheels on it, the magnums. Yeah, I do too. Yeah, this thing's got a great look. My favorite thing about these 66 um, Fairlanes are the, the front front grill and the stacked headlights. Hmm. And then yeah. the taillights are always neat on these too. I like the quarters, how they, you know, that, those years, how they're just straight back like that. Just has a good line to it. Uh, fantastic line, beautiful roof line too. So that's a neat car that'll be getting checked in in the coming days and making its way to the website. And I think back in Mike's Bay, there's some more Ooh. new inventory to check out that you haven't seen. This uh, Trans Am is really neat, 95, so still had the LT1. Um, special dealer order color, this purple, um, was actually factory on this car. 20,000 original miles. Wow. Mike, does it still smell like a new car in there? Pretty much, yeah. Drives like one. Yeah, it looks like one too. 20,000 original miles, just super well cared for. It's got the T-tops too, which is awesome. Yeah, definitely like that. And I like this color just because you're not going to see it on on anywhere many else. Them. Yeah, being a special. Well, now it's getting color. to the point where you don't see quite that many out there of these cars on no, the road don't. anymore. It's been that many years. Yeah, these are definitely a classic. Mm -hmm. It's hard to believe that we could say that. But. I know. They're neat, though. And they're fun to drive, you know, because they, they kind of handle more like your, your modern car. There's still good power to them. They just have a really neat 
neat look that you don't see much of anymore. Yep. Little Mercury. Tim's got all the interior pieces off. Remember they came blue. So he's stripping the paint and gonna repaint them to match the interior. This will be a cool car too. This is definitely something if you want a car that nobody else has at the at the car shows and things like that. This is you don't see I'm too many of these monitors. We've had a lot of a lot of calls on this thing already just from the really? video we Good. did a while back. But Tim's just going through buttoning up that interior. Did you check out that engine compartment? I thought that looked super cool with that air cleaner assembly on the top. That does. Big 390 in there. Yeah. But you know, you could tell when they did the restoration, they did a nice job where it's got, you know, the paint on the inner fenders is nice and shiny. Yeah. You know, new bolts when they did the restoration. Big block with power brakes, power steering. Yep. Good things. What do you think about it, Murph? And the 61 Cutlass is getting ready to ship oh, out. Oh, that thing is awesome. It's going to Florida. I missed that car already. There's a couple like that Camaro that we just drove and like this one where I just wish we would have just like not Could listed it them. until I got taken yeah. to a couple car shows. Yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. just it. That's the hardest part. Oh, for sure. It is. Hey, thank you guys for watching. We definitely got some neat new inventory in and it's coming in every single day. Uh, make sure you go to the website coyoteclassics.com. I'll we'll put a link down in the comment section. There you're gonna see all the cars that we didn't go over today that are already on the site. Prices, photos, pictures, video, all that kind of good stuff. So make sure you check that out. And if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel already, make sure you go ahead and do that. We'll post one of these every Wednesday and uh, inventory walk-arounds almost daily. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Thanks.